Welcome to DC Trending News, the leading news channel about world political events. Today's news, the first Ukrainian soldiers to get their hands on British weapons give extra hope to repel Russian troops. The first Ukrainian troops to be trained on British donated heavy artillery systems said it would give the whole nation extra hope and motivation to beat back Russia. The Daily Express was invited to observe the latest Ukrainian troops completing their training on L-119 multiple rockets. And like guns on Salisbury Plain, we witnessed the troops firing shell after shell into the Wiltshire countryside to practice the new weapons for the fight against Vladimir Putin's forces, according to this newspaper. Kiev will receive three MLRS systems capable of hitting targets 52 miles away, as well as about 50 L-119 guns. The Ukrainian soldiers thanked the British troops for their training and added, it is really important for us to understand that the world has not forgotten us, soldiers from the Royal Artillery. Regiment trained dozens of Ukrainians on the multiple launch rocket systems, MLRS, in a three-week crash course. Normally, training for British soldiers takes five weeks, but military chiefs have decided to speed up the training so the soldiers can return to the front line. Some of the translators working alongside British and Ukrainian troops fled to Britain as refugees after Vladimir Putin's invasion of Ukraine. Captain James Oliphant, who oversaw the training on the MLRS system, said, Now they are extremely competent with this system, it's like showing a child how to ride a bike. They no longer want you to hold on to the back of the seat, they are at a point now where they just want to go back and operate the equipment, he said. Captain Oliphant said the British troops worked with the Ukrainian soldiers from 8 a.m. to 6 p.m. seven days a week throughout the time they were here. In total, British troops have trained more than 450 Ukrainian soldiers in a mix of MLRS. L-119 light rifles, air defense techniques and surveillance and target acquisition in recent weeks, Ukrainian commanders said they were really impressed with the British MLRS and are now considering how to use the missile systems to repel Russian advances in the Donbass. Kiev has asked the West for more long-range heavy artillery systems to attack Russian forces advancing in eastern Ukraine. Defense Minister Ben Wallace said Russian forces were gaining ground almost at the level of the First World War. Meters, the Kremlin is relying on brutal artillery attacks to bring Ukraine to its knees, a Ukrainian major told the Daily Express that Britain's handover of the MLRS to Kiev gives the war-torn country new hope of beating back Moscow's killers, he said. When others in our armed forces learn that we have MLRs, they will be strongly motivated, which is very important for all of us, not only for the armed forces, but for all the Ukrainian people to understand that we are strong, we are so grateful for your support and help. We are very grateful for the team of trainers. It's really important for us to understand that the world has not forgotten us and remembers our struggle. The Ukrainian commander added, our Ukrainian boys are in a fighting mood and ready to return. They understand that they are preparing to improve the situation. We are confident that they will help us in our fight. A month ago, all the Ukrainian troops who are here were on the battlefield. We are here to improve our knowledge, to learn something new, to continue our fight, the only word I can use to describe the feeling is tiredness, they are really tired. At the beginning, they were a little anxious about the situation. Now they are just tired, but at the same time, they are so motivated to continue their fight, he said, the major said Ukrainian troops were really impressed with the weapon systems, he said, we are confident that we can win with these systems, the tactical characteristics of these systems are much better than our Ukrainian systems. They are much more usable for us against the Russians, it's about the mobility and the speed, the accuracy of this system and the survivability of this and the Ukrainian troops. Captain Oliphant acknowledged that Ukrainian troops were clearly particularly motivated and extremely willing to learn. He said, when we learned that they were professional rocket artillerymen, the pace of the course and the delivery became much easier. Despite the language barrier between Ukrainian and English, we spoke the same language. 